morning everybody it is now monday the 20th of july it's another week another weekly vlog i am just about to edit last week's together i'm cooking some breakfast having some egg on toast got a cup of tea um we'll put the news on in the morning i like to watch the news in the morning yeah it's another week let's see what it brings um it's a nice day so i'll probably go out down to my mum's have a nice walk with jennifer after i finish work like i said i'm gonna edit together um last week's video so it can go up later on today last night's video which was the weekly wrap-up number two for some reason it took forever to upload i don't know what's going on usually our upload speeds are really good it's just every now and again i get one that gets stuck and it takes forever to do and i just i went to bed and left it and then when i got up it in the night to go to the bathroom about half past one in the morning because i bathroom downstairs i came down and it was done so i put it live so it went live a bit late but it's it's there I don't know what's going on with it. Hmm. Never mind. Anyway, like I said, I'm cooking some breakfast. I'm just getting myself sorted. I'm going to put the news on. I'll see you after work. Right, I've finished work and I'm just going to get Jennifer dressed and we're going to walk down to Mum and Dad's. I've been reading and looking through a little bit of the Judy Garland book that I'm currently reading. I'd like to try and get that finished this week. I'm about halfway through it now. So it's doable because there's not a lot of text to read. It's mostly pictures, but there is some text. So I do want to read it. So I'm going to try and do a bit more of that later. Tonight, um, I'm not filming today. I'm going to be f photographing as much as I can for eBay because I haven't listed anything for weeks. So sales are dropping off. So tonight I'm going to do as much photographing as I possibly can. Tomorrow I'll be filming. I finally finished the picture for my Crayola video. So I'm going to get that one finished um, now, tomorrow after I've done my colouring chat and then I'll be doing um, another video I've got a couple of books to still flip through I didn't do them yesterday so that's it really I'm gonna ed go, go get this um, yeah go and get Jennifer dressed and get her down to mum and dad's and we'll go and have a nice walk see what's going on at granddad's now and Jennifer's gonna do the garden aren't you which one do you want like that one or this one You want to scoop you? Mm -hmm. On the right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> now you're being awkward. Yeah, she's always awkward. Put it in there. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. A bit high. There we are. Yeah, that's a bit high too. Daddy! Daddy! Oh, oh, oh. trying to do baby what you gonna have no. I can't have four I've only got two hands there you go pick that up look and then pick it up and put it in there and grab that okay we took it out of there and we put it back in there <laughs> put it in there there Oh, there we go. Daddy, daddy. Yeah, daddy, yeah, daddy got this. Granddad got to do something as well. Okay. There we go. Okay. Oh dear. Oh, oh dear. Oh, Rubbish. Where is Going over there, shall we? Granddad got the yellow one. Right? And that one. So you're going to put it back in there, are you? That's right. Concentrate too much. I know, she's so That's sweet. That's good. In there, anywhere I do. Tip it up. Can you grab that do some as well? Ah, oh, look at you. Use the, rake, use the rake like that, look. Do that one. No. Oh, no, no. Do that one. <laughs> good girl. That's her favourite. Oh, that looks good. Well done, Jennifer. So Jennifer's having fun in the garden with Grandad today. Oh, never mind. Never mind. Daddy! Here we go. 
Ooh. Hey, Jenny. Who's that? Baby. Look at that. What's that? Big daddy. Yeah. Good girl. I love her little legs when she's running. She's so cute. On the way home now. There we are. Hello. You made it. Ooh. Now, time for tea, sausage, chips Ooh. and beans for Jennifer. Isn't that right? Hey, baby. Say hello. Oh, and uh, some salad for Paul. So, and sausage chips and beans for me. So that's it, I'm gonna pull my order after and take that down tomorrow. Might take Jen for a walk, see if the park's open. Fingers crossed it is, otherwise I'll be in trouble. Yeah, do some eBay afterwards, I guess. I'll show you what I'm doing with that later. Hey guys, it's uh, Monday evening. Um, everybody's in bed, except for me, as usual. Um, well, it's not that late. It's only 25 to 10. And I have just been photographing some items. I've just photographed eight items of non-clothing for eBay. Um, I've used this. This is my light tent, and my light's behind it, as you can see. Here's the bag of stuff I've listed. There's a load of DVDs, a bundle of... Uh, PlayStation 3 games because they're not worth much on their own. There's five there, put them on for tenner. Pair of uh, Marks and Spencer shoes, which I got really cheap. There's some minimal wear to the the soles, but not much. And a one kilo bundle of jewellery, as well as uh, five DVDs sets to go off. Um, so, yeah, that's, that's what I photographed tonight, and that's all I'm photographing tonight. Uh, I have got. I think two more items ready, so that makes ten. So that gives me five for tomorrow and five for Wednesday. And I will try and photograph some clothing tomorrow, bring up some cameras. Basically the non um, clothing items are quite easy to photograph. I just open up the light tent, pop it on the bed with the light behind it, and like I have tonight and it away with it so that lot can now go down i've just got to put the names of the games into the listing i'm going to do that now because i can take all that stuff then up to the shed and put it away yeah you can go away out of the way uh so that tomorrow um i'll be filming coloring catch up and a few other bits and pieces i've got to flip through to do and there's some few others uh, i'm going to be finishing a video off that i've been working on for a little while Trying to uh, get to the near point of finishing another one that I've been working on for a little while. And um, generally just pottering on. I'm watching Slapped Ham again tonight. Um, if you watched my wrap-up video last week, you'll have seen that. I've linked that down below in that video because I, it's just a channel I like. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to pack the, the light tent away, put the light off and turn it around. And I'm going to sit in bed, do a bit of colouring, take my medication, like my asthma medication and stuff like that I need to take before bed. And just colour for a bit and then in about half an hour I'll, I'll probably turn the light off and go to sleep but yeah a packed day today feel better now I've done a bit of photographing for eBay I know I need to do a lot more I've got to get back to it I've, got, I've still got a load of clothing to do so I do want to to photograph uh, as much as I can over the next few days because I want to clear that corner out so I can get the stuff up there that I need the only problem is when it's all photographed and this stuff I've got no more clothing stock to list I have got a load of cameras though so I want to get the photographs for that lot done and up. Which goes. And then I'll, I'll I'll just have to focus on, on getting as many cameras checked and listed as possible. I've got uh, a complete camera system to list. So I think it's got three lenses and a flash and then one camera with just a lens. So I'd probably get 30 quid and 20 quid. Maybe a bit more for the one with all the lenses. So I must bring that down and, and do that one. So this doesn't take too long to set up. So I might actually bring those down and do them tomorrow uh, when I'm doing my videos. Anyway, that's it for tonight. Um, I'm going to see you tomorrow. Have a nice evening. Bye, guys. Morning, everyone. It's Tuesday morning. I've got the news on because it's the only chance I get to watch it. I've got a bag here of colouring stuff, which I've brought down with some whips I want to finish this afternoon after work. Um, possibly out in the garden. It's very, very nice out there. And I'll take Jennifer out there and... Uh, 
she, we can play and while she sometimes she just wants to play on her own and I just let her go on with that I'll colour while she's doing that when she wants me to play I'll go and play with her um, I did list three items last night on eBay I'm only listing two or three items because I haven't got much photographed I photographed eight items last night so I'll be putting those photographs up as well when I finish work and just because I haven't got a huge amount of photographs I'm just going to keep uh, the listed low till I get enough photographs um, there's a couple of cameras I mentioned yesterday I'm going to bring them down and uh, get them cleaned up and photographed and listed again I can use the tent for that I think I've got three I can photograph definitely there are some games up there that need to be checked I might do that this afternoon um, if I can uh, and that's it really there's some, there's some video games up there I can bring down and bundle the, the ones that are left now the ones that weren't worth selling on their own so I might uh, put bundles of five four or five together and, and just whack them on for a tenner and see what we can do so I'm getting ready for work now so it's uh, 25 to 8 start at 8 so I'm going to get my computer on in a minute it don't take long because we leave it on logged on um, at night for updates um, in case it needs to update so uh, they they like you to leave it because they remote in and patch put patches on so they haven't lately so and I can't tell whether they have at the moment so but yeah that's it really um just, uh, it's a nice day out looks lovely Paul's got to go for his walk and take my post down the road and drop it at the post office while uh, he's out because they they open well the spa opens at eight so we can drop it off at the post office and just leave it there it's fine they know me um and I'll see you after work hey guys. Tuesday night and I haven't vlogged all day mainly because there's just been not a lot to tell you about really I've had a shower and I'm just sitting here playing on cafe land on Facebook for five minutes before I go upstairs to make uh, the next part of my colour and chat video um, I've done um, a background on a Selena Fennec picture that I want to do from Fedorables because um, I wanted to use a, a black background so I thought I'd just use acrylic paint I just watered it down because acrylic paint's too thick otherwise watered it down and I've done that now so I can start colouring that possibly tomorrow if I I'm ready to do it um, and then I've got an idea of what I want to do with the rest of the background once I finish the picture um, but that won't be yet. I'm trying to finish off the whips I've got on the go I've got a couple of whips in a bag that I've brought down with me and I've been up the garden colouring today um, and a couple of um, upstairs to do so uh the current bag will come upstairs with me just in case i want to try and finish off one of those but i'm going upstairs to video in a minute but before i do that i'll show you the selena fennec picture i'm doing this is the selena fennec picture i'm doing from fedorables you can see it's a witch on her broom and uh, flying above the moon with a cat there were some stars down here i've covered them up because of my plan for it it's not quite dry but it's not far off you can see the pages are curling because it's not very thick paper um uh, but that'll flatten out when I'm uh, ready to, well, when I close the book and put something on top of it, really. But, yeah, that's how I wanted it to look. It's looking pretty good. I'm happy with that. So now I'm going to go and make today's video. Hey, so I'm here. I'm set up. I'm just watching a bit of uh, Slapped Ham at the moment. This is what we're working on. It's the skull from Magical Jungle. Using Secure Jelly Rolls. I've set up. I'm going to be starting any minute now. So I'm actually going to... Say good night for tonight and hopefully I'll actually do a bit of vlogging properly tomorrow. We will be going out, going to my mum and dad's tomorrow afternoon, so there might be something to vlog out there and on the way. You never know. I also want to read a bit of my book tonight, so that's why I'm knocking off. I'll see you tomorrow. Good morning everybody. It is Wednesday. I'm sitting at my computer ready to start work. It's about time. Just waiting for systems to load. Uh, I've got a video editing, so that's last night's colouring chat, which you'll have seen by now if you watch those. And I've got another one to edit after that, so things are coming together nicely now on some of the videos I've had in process for a while. And hopefully I'll be able to finish another one tomorrow night. Great. And then I'll be starting another one again, so another long one as well. Um, but yeah. So I'm going down to my mum's later, so I'll take you with me. Um, it's very quiet on eBay, I didn't list anything last night. I did have one sale yesterday, which is packed and ready to go. Um, yeah, it's just a matter of 
getting on with the morning and seeing what happens. So I'm going to go to work. Well, I'm at work. I'm going to do my work and see what happens afterwards. But yeah, we'll be going out. So oh, look at these roots. They're getting long. <laughs> anyway, I better crack on. Hey, yeah, Jen. Where you going? Come here then. Look, come here. No, oh, come here. Can you see yourself? Say hello. Say hello. <laughs> Good girl. So we're at mum and dad's at the moment, but we're going to go home now. We're going to go for a little walk with granddad, aren't we? Yes. So she's running with granddad going, no mummy, no mummy. <laughs> Otherwise, I'm not allowed to walk with them. <laughs> they start running on the grass in a minute, which is cute. So <laughs> I don't mind. You falling down? Mommy, mommy, She's all the way up there, and she's running so fast to try and get to me. Granddad holding on to her, it's <laughs> so cute. Baby, here she comes. Hi, I notice blackberries are out early, aren't they, Dad? Yeah, couldn't pick the ones here because. They're by the road, but there are some on the wreck. No, you get one on the wreck, don't you? Look at this. Sitting on a bench before we get home, and she's all curled up into Grandad. <laughs> and you, Jennifer. Yes, you? Okay. Mm. It's you, isn't it? Look. Who's that? Who's that? The baby. Is it baby? Baby. Yeah. Granddad, Baby and Grandad, yeah. Mm, Time for dinner, and it's burritos, chips and some coleslaw, sausage chips and ginger. I can't speak. Sausage chips and beans for Jen. She hit me in the lip. I got a bit of a thick lip. Here she comes. So I'm going to tuck in. I can't wait. I'm starving. It's Wednesday night. I'm about to pick a few items and photograph some of the clothing I've got. Today, this arrived. Hang on. This is a year planner called Day by Day with Marilyn. Text is by um, Michelle Morgan, my friend. And basically, it, it's just a planner. It's full of lovely pictures of Marilyn. It's made, it's got a, a, a bookmark in it. And it looks lovely. Uh, Text is by Michelle, but it's a very thick planner with lots and lots of gorgeous photographs and there's quotes. You can't see me properly. So I'll show you very quickly some of it. I won't be a second. This lovely cover shot. Gorgeous pictures of Marilyn, as you can see. Then it's not got a year in it, so you can put whatever year it is. I'm going to get one of these every month now for the end of the year. Month of January. And it's got a goals page and then a picture of Marilyn. More pictures of Marilyn, which is great. Dreams. And then you've got a calendar. So you can write the date in it and, and what you're doing. Quotes. And then um, a proper planner so you can like split the day up which I think is great. So, we'll just quickly flip through that. And then you've got um, noteworthy dates in Marilyn history from January's, and then the list of years, which is amazing. And it's got like the date next to it. So 15th of January, 1960, uh, Marilyn and co-star Yves Montand announced their joint project, Let's Make Love. So it's got that going through it. Then you've got noteworthy dates in your history. And another nice picture, a couple of pictures. February goals, February dreams. 
and the same again quotes you've got the, cat, the the actual diary pages not long enough for my diary but it's good for other things noteworthy february dates dates for you and so on and march and it's got all these absolutely gorgeous pictures of marilyn it's really too nice to write in um, i think it was 12.97 on amazon if i remember i'll pop a link to it down below um beautiful so there's march and just and all these pictures are stunning i'm not going to show you them all because i want you to go and buy it so yeah absolutely stunning so that's um day by day with marilyn a 12 month planner so you can pick that up on amazon I also got some metallic gel pens by Arteza, so I'll be doing a first impressions on these shortly. Um, I'm going to wrap it up for tonight because, uh, like I said, I really uh, want to go and uh, photograph a few eBay items uh, so I can get some stuff listed. I only listed three items today because I'm not listing much. So I'm going to crack on and try and photograph about six items. I'm happy with six for now. Uh, I'm running out of clothing stock. I've got a load of other stuff up the shed to do, so I'll be really pushing it on that soon, I think. So I'm going to crack on with that now, and I'll see you tomorrow morning. And it's Thursday tomorrow. Bye, guys. Hi, everyone. It's Thursday afternoon. I haven't vlogged today. The weather's not particularly nice, so we haven't been out. It's been raining. And um, I've got a very stiff neck and my back's been aching. It's probably from where I've been sitting awkwardly at the chair and sleeping awkwardly probably last night. So I haven't done anything. I haven't vlogged. Um, I've got a few bits to do in the shed later. So I'll take you up with me. I've got some stuff to take up there and put up. I've got one order to pull. So I'll do that. So I'll take you up with me when I go up. But I'm cooking tea now and it'll be the first time this week we've had to eat in the house. Which is a shame, but it is what it is. We've got to do uh, what we can. We can't eat outside when it's raining. But hopefully it'll be better tomorrow and we'll be able to get out and a bit, about a bit. So yes, even though I forgot to vlog, there wasn't exactly anything exciting happening. Uh, it's Thursday afternoon, uh, Friday afternoon now. Hooray, I finished work for the weekend. Yay, and we're going for a walk down to, to Nana and Grandad's, aren't we, baby? Yeah. yeah. So, it's nice to get out. I've got my the last of my new t-shirts out. Jump off of blondes. Quite like that one. And uh, yeah, we're on our way to Nana's. Jennifer loves these like all toddlers. She's not very good with them. Mm -hmm. She just tends to throw them around a bit. It's the only way she can get them off, isn't it? And that one doesn't want to come off at all. <laughs> if there's any more later on all right another one in the lane oh there they go the lane smells of lilac as you can see there's a lot of it around which is nice smells nice there's another one Jen here's another one look yeah there we are she just throws them around <laughs> she thinks they're fun. Didn't we all at that age though? The good thing is, bringing her out with her granddad is he weighs her out. All the running around makes her nice and tired. Which makes life easier later. They're looking for dandelion clocks at the moment. There's a few on the field, so. Butterflies. Lots of those around today, so. Nice day. A bit windy. It's very grey. Very cloudy, but uh, still a nice walk. There she is. Well, I'm on the way home. Dad and Jennifer are behind me because, uh, oops, lilac. Uh, whenever we walk home, I just let them get on with it because they take forever and I just walk on and it poodle. So I get to the bench and I sit down and wait for them. And it's only around the corner to the house, so it's not too bad, but it's so nice when they're together. You can just see them behind me over there. And uh, yeah, it's a nice day, it's a bit warm, cloudy and grey, it might rain later, but it's not too bad, so yeah, let's get home. Look at this, mm -hmm. sitting on a bed, cuddled up, I don't know. Awesome. Hey, Jen. 
Who's that? Who's that? Is that you? You know it's you. Uh, me. Yeah, you. Uh, it's your shoes come off. Uh, I'll put it on now, baby, okay? Mummy, put it back. And now she doesn't want him to go home. It's time for Granddad to go home, Jen. No. Why not? Is that Peter Rabbit? Is that Peter Rabbit? He goes fast, doesn't he, Peter Rabbit? No. Who's that? Ooh, ow. So it's tea time now. I've had a little sleep because I was tired. Jennifer's got her sausages. And she'll have some chips of mine and Paul's. And of course, we got fish and chips and mild curry sauce. So it's fish and chip Friday, isn't it, darling? It is. We always look forward to this from the village fish bar up at Bay's Leg. Thanks, guys. We love you. Right, Jennifer's in bed. It's quiz time. 70s, 80s, 90s, and noughties music. Let's see how bad we can do this week. End of round one. And um, we don't know where we are because he hasn't bothered to do the schools for some reason. After question one, we were in the lead because we got six points plus six bonus points, but we're not now because we did badly after that for a bit and then we sort of picked it up again. But we don't know, so I'll have to let you know if he ever tells us. Isn't that right? Yeah. And it's all frozen at the moment at their end, so we'll see. Okay, so at the end of round one, we were at 24. So now, as in true powder or fashion, we've moved down to 29 because this is the way it goes. We do quite well in the first round and then we start moving down the leaderboard as the quiz goes on. It's break now, so I'm off to do something very boring, which is check the washings dry. <laughs> so that's all over for another night. We finished at 30th out of 45. Not brilliant, not bad, it was a laugh. We had a few internet connection problems, as did the host, so it's just one of those things. He's just working out through the top 10 now, which we've only ever finished in the top 10 once, and that was the Brit Pop quiz, and I think we were ninth. So, yeah, never mind. There is another music quiz after, but we uh, don't do that one because it's the late, late music quiz, and it goes on to like half past one in the morning. We did it the first week, we did the quiz in for a laugh, and um, it destroyed us the next day. I'd love to do it again, but and there's also a lot of dance music, which we don't do. What we really want is a 50s and 60s music quiz I'd be well in on that one <laughs> that's it for tonight I'm going to go upstairs and watch a movie possibly or maybe just some YouTube now it's a bit late for films but we have another quiz tomorrow we have the general knowledge one which is always good fun and uh, who knows what we'll be up tomorrow tomorrow's Saturday Woohoo! I'll see you guys in the morning have a nice night hi everybody oh I'm all out of focus I don't know why what's happened there there we go it's Saturday, it's late, it's early afternoon. Um, slept in late today because uh, we did a quiz last night and then I coloured for a bit and watched some YouTube. Finished off two of my whips, I'm happy about that. And then at three o'clock Jennifer woke up and started crying. So that was me up for the next hour or so and then of course I can't get back to sleep. And eventually she did, she actually had me up twice. The first time I put her, I put her back, she was all right. She lay down and then half an hour later, she was awake again crying. So I went back in again. Pulled her out, gave her a cuddle. She just wanted to chat for a bit. She chatted to me for about half an hour, put her back down and, and she was fine after that. But, I, you know, once that's happened, it's just disturbed your sleep and you can't go back off to sleep properly. So oh, I'm out of breath. We had a, a bit of a late lie in today, but um, obviously we've been up for a while now. But still later than normal normally she has us up at eight o'clock but not this morning um obviously she was sleeping as well so today's plan is we're doing the shopping today because it's supposed to rain this afternoon and then tomorrow we'll hopefully be going to cardiff to have a proper wander around the lake uh the whole circumference because it's supposed to be slightly better in cardiff tomorrow it's raining today but it's nice tomorrow fingers crossed it stays that way. it's supposed to rain in risk all day so we're going to go to the shop do our week to shop i've got to drop some stuff down at my mum's and then, uh, I've forgotten. And then we'll be coming back, putting the shopping away, having lunch and pottering around uh, the house. Uh, I'll probably do some colouring with Jennifer later and some playing with Jennifer. Um, tonight we're doing another quiz. And normally tonight I film the weekly wrap up. So I don't know if I'm going to get to do that. It might have to be filmed tomorrow and go up tomorrow because I've also got to do 
a colour and chat for tomorrow. I might still film it tonight because I've got to do the colour and chat as well. And then you get two videos on Sunday. I didn't put one up on, on, on Friday either. So. So you probably get two on Sunday. I might put a, a flip through up. So I don't know. I'm, I'm musing to myself now. So I'm going to. I've got to get Jennifer dressed and uh, get all the shopping gear together. And I'll see you a bit later. Back from shopping now. It's really close and muggy and horrible. It's raining out. Jennifer's just had an ice lolly. I'm going to go and have a shower because I feel really manky and horrible. So oh, it's just so close. It's horrible. So I'm going to have a quick shower, sort some washing out. And then we'll see what happens later. But, got up so late, I don't even want any lunch. So I'll have something after I've had my uh, little shower. I'll be back. Let's see what's going on. As you can hear, she's asking for more ice lolly, basically. But Daddy's eating, so she'll have to wait. So I've had a shower, I feel much better now. Paul and Jennifer, they've gone out for a little walk. So happy with that, shopping's all done, put away. Had a shower, there's a load of washing on. I'm all clean, it's still hot, it's still very muggy. Um, I'm gonna do a bit of filming now for the channel. While they're out, not a huge amount, just a little bit of uh, finishing off a couple of videos or one video that I've got that I need to finish off. And I'm going to then chill out and watch some slap tam until they get back. And then we'll see what happens. She'll probably want to sleep when she's had a walk because she she runs back and forth like there's no tomorrow. She's she's so funny. But uh, it's nice for her and Paul to have a bit of time on their own. So it's good that she wants to go out with him. She likes it when I go as well. And she'll get to a certain point and she'll be, Mummy, Mummy, and she'll want to come back. And that's fine. But uh, she does love walking with her dad, which I think is wonderful. So... Right, I'm going to crack on and get this bit of filming finished. It's so warm, I'm going to put the fan on after I've done that. When I'm just watching a bit of slap time and drinking my cup of tea. So it's a nice chilled Saturday. Uh, I might try and read a bit because I do need to film the weekly wrap up as well at some point. Yeah, need to do that. Hmm. It's all over the place where I'm doing stuff at the moment and what days I'm going to put them up. So. I haven't quite decided what I'm doing, so I'm a bit over the place, but uh, yeah. I'm also sitting on my inhaler, which is not good. I'd better crack on. I'll see you in a bit. So we're doing the quiz. Jennifer is in bed. First round started badly, got a bit better, and then tailed off towards the end. We did get a few points extra on the, you know, the being fast. Not the fastest, but faster. So we're waiting on the scores. We're not at the end. So we're just looking through. Not the power puffs. No, well, we're higher than we, I, we're a lot higher than I thought we'd be. Wow! No way. We're at fifteenth. Wow! Wasn't expecting that. It's time for a break. Toilet. Crisps. Beers. More beers. Definitely more beer. End of round two, and as predicted, it all went downhill. They were a lot harder questions. We didn't do very well at all. So we'll see how far we've dropped down in now. When he puts the scores up, obviously. Let's see where we are. How bad we are. Let me just say, well, we're not at the bottom. Quizzy Shicks at 39, so we're still higher than them. Okay, okay. 20 seconds. We've dropped from 15 to 22. This is typical of what happens with these quizzes. We start off well and it all goes downhill. Anyway, it's time for a drink break, toilet break, crisp break, whatever you want to break. End of round three. And as predicted, not as good. These questions are so hard. I mean, there was, in the second round, there was one question that nobody got right. And on this round, there was somewhere where there was one person got it right, or three people got it right, and six people got it right. We were one of them on one of them, weren't we? We got one of them right on one of us, like nine people. So we're waiting for the schools. Let's see how bad it is this time. Let me just move that out of the way. And here we go. Here we go. Okay, so. Here's things. So, yeah, okay, 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 okay. Oh. We've gone up to 19. Well, we weren't expecting that, I'm not going to lie. Anyway, I need to eat, to eat those crisps. 
He doesn't want to eat the spicy knickknacks. I really want to eat the spicy knickknacks. I'll find something else. I'm going to the loop. Back for round four soon. To the end of the round. Where did we end up? So that round was weird because it was like evil mode where they deduct points if you get it wrong, but if you don't answer, you stay where you are. 21. So we ended at 21, which is about a mid table, isn't it? Yeah, it was about where we normally end up, is about mid table. Except for in the. Um, Brit pop quiz. We came in ninth. That's the best one we've done so far. But uh, yeah, I have to try and convince Paul to do a movie one with me again soon. Cause, but he hates that because he doesn't know movies, and a lot of it is Disney, and I don't know Disney. But as they do a Disney quiz, really, they shouldn't put any Disney questions into their movie quizzes. There you go. I enjoy them. Anyway, that's it for now. Um, don't know what I'm going to do now. Might watch a film. Might watch some TV. Might watch some YouTube. Who knows? I'm going to finish my drink though. I'll see you in the morning. Sunday, hopefully, we'll be getting out tomorrow. Paul's dropped off. <laughs> it's alright, it's just a laugh. Bit of fun. MB quizzes, if you're interested in joining. Um, speedy trivia on Facebook. MB quizzes, Ticket Taylor. If you want to join in, if you want to MB quizzes on Google. I'll give you a list of all the quizzes when they are, how much, and they're all £5 plus a booking fee of 35 pence. Uh, when they are and what time they are, remember this is UK, so it's um, British summertime, so it's be and it'll be, um, say, 8 o'clock BST or 7.30 BST. So just remember that if you're not in the UK. But yeah, they're good fun. It's worth joining in. See you tomorrow. Good morning, it's Sunday, and we're going to go out in a minute for a quick walk quick walk I say that we're going to try and walk around Roth Lake um, so we've got to get there first it's going to be that quick I uh, just got to get Jennifer dressed now I'm dressed and ready Paul's dressed and ready so now we've got to catch the two-year-old well she's two and a half nearly but she does like to run away and hide when we're trying to get her dressed for some reason but hey I'm going to go and catch the baby, get her changed, head off to Roth Lake we're going to try and walk around the entire circumference of the lake today try and wear her out a bit <laughs> And then I'm hopefully going to do some more whips. I've got nine completed pages so far this month. We've got another week to go. Like I said, I've, I'm finishing whips. I'd obviously started one last night on a colour and chat, which you should have seen by now. And then uh, I've got a, a Christmas one to complete up here that I started, and a couple downstairs uh, that I'm going to do, including some patterns. They won't take long. The pattern ones are nearly, well, one of the pattern ones is nearly finished, so I'm going to. Attempt to finish a couple today if I get a chance, so if she has a dose this afternoon it won't be a problem, but if she doesn't, do not matter, I'll do it tonight. Um, yeah, I'll see you at Roth. I made it to Roth, I'm looking at all the swans, looking for food. You right, baby? Come on then. So we're going to walk all the way around. Enjoying the cone of her ice cream, aren't you baby? A lovely day, you know, the clouds are up and it's supposed to shower. Hey, baby! Yeah! Nice. Here's a Scott Memorial because, of course, Scott left from Cardiff to go on his uh, ill fated uh, journey. I have taken some progress of this over the years, I can tell you. There's so much to see in the uh, Roth Gardens and Lake. Oh dear, someone's not happy. Get an ice cream from there. It's got a fine pool now. There he is up there. It's the boat landing stages. Of course, they're not out at the moment. So, wish him well. Plenty of ducks, geese, and swans, pigeons, and seagulls. As you can see. The thing is, they do start thinking you've got food if you stop. The one thing about uh, Jennifer and Paul going off on their own is that um, I've got the car keys, so they can't get home without me.
a lovely walk. So you see over there in the distance is the Scott Memorial. Looks like it's a lot further away than it actually is. It's only a quick walk. <laughs> and she's off again. All she wants to do is run, which is sweet. I must say, all this uh, extra walking I've been doing, going to my mum's, I'm finding it a lot easier and doing this stuff. Getting up and down, the, walking up and down the hill at home now, so that's good. It's great. At the end now, as you can see, there's boys across the lake because this part of the lake they use for boating. That part of the lake is more of a nature reserve where the birds lay their eggs and they nest a lot. They do nest along other parts of the lake as well, but it's a safe space for them. As you can see, she's miles ahead as usual. I don't mind. And there's the island. What's it called, Paul? I think that one's Hendrix Island. Why is it called that? Because Jimi Hendrix slept there. <laughs> that's, that's the legend. The legend is that Jimi Hendrix slept on the island in Rofe Lake. <laughs> Mostly it's used for nesting birds these days, isn't it? Yeah. So we're at the end of the lake. Over the road is the wild gardens where the wild garlic grows and it stinks. It's nice though, isn't it, Paul? Yeah. And here they've got all the, the ducks and pigeons and gulls. Paul and Jennifer off again, they just don't stop. Yeah. You like the babies, don't you, Jen? She's still running. She's made it all the way around the lake. I'm surprised because it's quite big for a little one. Probably she'll have some lunch and fall asleep this afternoon, which is uh, great for me. It means I can get some jobs done. What's really nice is seeing the reactions of people's faces when she runs past them, especially the old people. They just smile and it, it makes their faces break out in happiness because she's just so sweet. Um, we were in the supermarket yesterday. The lady behind the till, Lucy, was saying how much she'd grown because she sees us most weeks, because we hadn't been in for a long time, hadn't seen her for like a few months because of lockdown. Seeing how chatty she was and how much she'd grown and it was really nice. And she does, she makes everybody smile. And it's such a, a lovely thing to see a little girl just being a toddler and how much they bring happiness to people. Not just me and my family, but when we were in Tenerife last October, they were all fussing over I guess because it's Spanish and she's blonde which is an unusual hair colour over there I guess but they all thought how gorgeous she was then and oh now look at her she's fabulous back home now so I get to put the washing away <laughs> lucky me um oh it was a lovely walk around the lake we could go again next week but we're gonna go to another part of the park the park is so big growth area is so big you got the lake, you got the rose gardens. You got the wild gardens by the lake, which I pointed out, which we haven't been in. They're, they, they're hard to walk around, obviously, because it's wild. Might show you that another time. Um, and then there's another part of the flower garden that's across the road. Um, it's a bit further, a bit further from, but we've never been in that. But, well, I've never been in that. Paul has, because obviously he lived in the area. So next week we're going to do that. But uh, yeah, we're home now. Poor Jennifer was sick in the car. She. She used to throw up when she was in the baby baby seat uh, rear facing, um, but now I think because we haven't been in the car very much for so long, she's fine getting motion sickness. She was um, wasn't feeling very well last week when we came back, and she was coughing. I know when she's coughing, she's going to throw up, but she didn't throw up. But we stopped at McDonald's to pick up some lunch, and I think that little extra bit on the journey, poor kid, um, really did it. So of course we had to bring her in, and then she didn't want me to change as she wanted daddy so uh, daddy was cleaning up the mess in the car so we swapped and i did that and then she didn't want anybody changing her but she didn't want to be in her dirty wet sicky clothes either so she was kicking off a bit i think she's a bit tired as well from all the running around the lake so i changed her we managed to get her changed completely and then she was fine she's had a bit of lunch and she's drunk some water which is great so she's hydrating herself so 
I think it's just motion sickness. We're going to have to do something or get something for her before we go to, to Weymouth later in the year because that's a long drive. And while I'm happy to stop at the services, I don't want to stop at every services and I don't want to have to change your clothes and clean the car at every services. Um, but we're going to have to sort that out. So anyway, I'm going to put this wash in around, away and um, we'll see if she'll have a sleep. And now I'm just going to put her, I think, tidy up a bit and... Um, probably put more washing on because I spilled ice cream on me uh, when we were at the lake but yeah it was a lovely walk I hope you enjoyed seeing a bit more of the area you'll see a bit more next week when we go to the other section um, as long as the weather's nice which hopefully will be as you can see it's, it's muggy today I'm sweating it's sort of running off me here uh, it's it's muggy it's not hot it's actually it's quite chilly when the wind goes but it is muggy and close so my least favourite kind of weather. I don't mind it being hot if it's dry. It's when it's like this, I don't like it. But, uh, yeah, so poor Jen. She's fine now. Like I said, she was fine. As soon as we got her into clean clothes, and she's fine. She's chattering away and, you know, she's happy enough. So we've got to get her back used to the car and maybe get her something. I don't know. I mean, I used to suffer from motion sickness when I was little. So did Paul, so it's not surprising, really. We've just been lucky so far. Anyway, I'm going to get this washing away. See you in a bit. Sunday night and we've had our dinner and we are now going to give Jennifer a bath uh, but she is hiding under the big table for some reason. She thinks it's a game so we've got to catch the baby, give her a bath and put her to the bed. Don't you just love Sundays? Guys it's uh, Sunday night, everybody's in bed except for myself. I'm actually going to go and have a quick shower because I feel all manky, look at the roots. Um, I will get my hair done. I just can't face sitting with a mask on for three hours. So what I'm going to do is I think I might book one for next month. I'll give them a ring and just practice sitting around with a mask on. So, uh, yeah, let's so try and do that next month. It needs it. <laughs> Anyway, I'm off for a shower and to bed. Oh, it's been a great week. I've had a lovely week. Like, today was lovely, apart from Jennifer being sick. But I guess what? We'll get to do the whole week again tomorrow. A new week, more work, unfortunately. But hey, we've got to earn our pennies, haven't we? And uh, I'll see you all in the next weekly vlog very soon. Bye, guys.